Yo, well, hi guys, Kevin here. Welcome back to Forza Horizon Adventure, and we're coming up to this point where we left off last episode. And it looks pretty tight, to be honest. It looks like it has some nice sections coming up. Um, hopefully, we can find some more XP uh, boards. Uh, we can find some find some nice sections of drift. That's what I want at the moment. Um, obviously, there's a lot of cars on the road, so it is hard to link drifts together. Um, but hopefully. We can start linking some together, uh, getting some more points, and finding out some nice areas to drift in. Obviously, that was a very nice corner, that felt really smooth. Uh, but up here, it looks like a very nice place. Um, I can see on the left we can go into the park. I don't know if that will have a nice section in there or not, but we can have a look. Um, let's just try and get some drifting going right now. I love the fireworks everywhere on this game, it just adds a lovely effect to like the festival vibe. Um, obviously on the last one you only had fireworks in that around the actual horizon place, uh, like the cent uh, central place. Uh, so uh, that adds a nice effect, I'm really enjoying this game, it's, it's probably the most fun I've had on a racing game. And with the added effect of Forza 5 tuning on this game as well, that's just epic. Like it's got the Forza 5 simulation feel, uh, but also in an arcadey way, if that makes any sense. Um, it's not, it's not like a simulation like Forza 5 is, but with the fact that they put tuning on, it do, it does have a it does have a more simulation feel than uh, Forza Horizon did the first one. So yeah, sorry about this. I'm just failing right now. Um, Let's try and get it going a little bit better. Yeah, so these roads link in quite well, seeing as the, the streets are quite close together. Uh, but obviously... Get out of the way! Oh, 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 that fucked me up. I was going in quite good then. So it's, it's quite good to drift around towns, I always found that on the uh, old Forza Horizon as well. Uh, just drifting around towns, just linking in corners, uh, you can all... Oh my god, that was terrible. Uh, you can always get a nice run going. And there was a 240 behind me, if you saw that. Um, is there any roads I've got to discover around here? There's one on my right, I've only got the half of it, so I can go down here. whip it into this corner. Nice. Nice cobbled road. But yeah, this this game feels really good for drifting. Um, it, it hasn't got the Forza 5 feel to the drifting. Um, it's got a little bit looser on, on the on the Force feedback. It feels much, much looser. It, it feels like I'm playing kind of um, R Factor but a little bit stronger. Um, the force feedback's pretty similar to R Factor, so uh, let's have a look around this park. And I think I just saw an XP board behind me. Yep, I did. So let's go grab that. I don't know where it is. Up here? There it is. Oh, it's a fast travel board. There we go. So we got that. Uh, I don't think there's much else in this place, to be honest. Uh, but it's got some nice corners in it. Um, I haven't got this road to the right hand side. Might as well go grab that road as we're going past. Highly skilled driver tar, that one. Average driver tar. I love how it uh, grades the um, driver tars. I don't know if it's graded in terms of car, because that's a supercar and um, the other one was not in a supercar, but I don't know if it's graded in that or you can find people from like Fiat or whatever. Um, with a pro driver tire, I don't know. I don't know how it is graded, but I'm sure we'll find out on this on this series. Uh, but yeah, this is the start of the series, to be honest. So we're still trying to discover good places to drift. Um, this town is quite nice to drift in, to be honest. Um, pretty flat roads. Um, the roads are quite close together, so you can link link some nice drifts together. And I'm just going about and discovering all the roads around here. I might as well discover them while I'm here drifting around. Um, but I haven't really found a section that is that is kind of 
caught my eye yet. Let's see that. Oh, went in quite angled for that one. So yeah, this car is absolutely epic. Uh, you guys smashed the likes in the last episode. Happy about that. And thanks for you guys for actually watching, because I know you used to love the old Horizon adventure. And I don't know what the fuck's in here. Uh, I know you guys used to love that, so to bring this back, it's fun to play this game, so I can't see anything going wrong with this series, to be honest. Okay, that's the most random shortcut I've ever seen in all my life. Turn the radio off so you can hear some of the engine. Oh, really? You're in a jeep and you're doing that. <laughs> you dear kid. Me. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it for this area, little area, to be honest. Um, this road up here I haven't got yet. Get out of the way. I haven't got this road here, and that's pretty much it for this area. Let's have a quick look down here. Looks a very tight road on the right hand side down here. Let's go have a quick butcher at that. Um, up here, if we go right. If we go right here, this looks okay. Oh shit, that was not okay then. <laughs> The drifting was not okay, but this plate. Oh, am I really wedged? Burnout. Nope, that didn't work. Okay, I'm actually, I'm actually wedged. Just let me out. There we go. I don't care about your motorbikes. Get them out of the way. Okay, maybe it wasn't as good as I thought that section would be. <laughs> I saw it on the map and I was like, yep, that looks okay. Guess not. I just realised I've been drifting in gear 2 when I tuned this car to drifting in gear 3. Oh wow, that's terrible. I've never been to the beach. I ain't been down here yet. That looks sick. Look at all the pedestrians on there. That is wicked. Wow. That actually looks sick, I'm not going to lie. Wow. The scenery on this game, look how far you can see in the distance. You can see that mountain in the distance. I love this game. I, I'm not even going to lie, I'm just, I'm in love. It's, I, think, I think it's the first love. <laughs> now nah, I'm joking. Alright, let's go. How much, how much speed can we get? There's a speed camera coming up. Boom! 165, but we're still building. We are going 188. 100 and what? 200. 206 we topped out at. Fuck, I didn't even know this car could go that fast. Alright, let's go and let's go to a new place, I guess. Let's go over here. I don't know where this goes. No, I do know where this goes actually. I've been down here before. This is a very nice area for drifting down here. There's a nice boat in the ocean there. Very nice. Catching some slides on the way down. Try and get some speed back up. Oh shit, I've got to make it through. Oh, there's a ramp! I can remember this ramp. Oh shit! actually died. Um, any nice areas? I'm trying to see if there's any sections, if you know what I mean. Oh, I got a wheel spin. Let's go. 
I'm feeling lucky. Lucky, lucky, lucky. I'm feeling lucky. Oh, that was so close to the Evo. We got 15,000 credits for all about that life. And I think I've got another one, actually. No, I've got perks, though. Uh, what shall I buy? Your destination vote? No. <laughs> you earn double the reward from the daily. Yeah, let's just do that. I think I'm just going to work around in a square, just like get that one, get that one, get that one. I don't really care what I get, to be honest, because I'm going to get them all in the end, so. Let's just catch some slides around this in industrial estate. Oh, there's little ramps. Beast. Oh, I thought I could make that. There we go. Wait up. Oh yeah buddy, I've actually done that bucket list and that car is a very nice car to drift. I've done this uh, bucket list as a co-op challenge and me and my mate were drifting it at the same time and it was absolutely insane to drive with. going to be honest, I'm just kind of driving in a general direction, um, there isn't kind of any direction to it at all. Um, if you go in, if you go behind me, if you go up there, there's an XP card, XP card right at the end, uh, so if you didn't know that then just head there, there's a very long pier, you can get up to like 200 miles an hour down it, let's jump off there, what? Alright, let's try and get through a few of these containers, see what they're saying. I love how you can smash stuff. Ah, this, I love this game, I'm not even going to lie. Oh yeah! Oh yeah, jump drift! Well, it's kind of like drifting and then jumped in the middle, so that's kind of a jump drift. Oh, the force feedback just wasn't there then. What the fuck? It was like, nope, <laughs> not happening. Let's take a right off of this ramp and see what we can... Ah, it didn't really start a drift. It kind of straightens up when you go over the ramp. We are going in right now. This place is quite nice to drift in. Nice industrial area. It's like a it's kinda like Jim a little bit. And so much stuff to drift around. I wonder if you can go through the middle of these. Obviously not that bit, but yeah you can. That's pretty epic. Oh shit. <laughs> I tried to drift through it and that happened. Boss. <laughs> yep, that didn't happen. Um, but yeah, it's been a fun episode. We found this nice industrial area. We found a few signs. We got some roads discovered. Uh, nice was quite a nice area. It wasn't amazing, but yeah, I don't think there's going to be any nice drift areas. Obviously, there's going to be some nice roads, but it was like you couldn't find a good section that was flowy. Um, kind of looking for some nice drift sections to do some nice tandem areas um, but yeah this industrial areas maybe could kind of think up a uh, route but in terms of um, just drifting it it's, it's been fun so we're gonna head up this way up next episode uh, head towards sister sister run there's some nice hairpins there I don't know what's going on down there um, and then head to the airport after that, I guess. So, 
Hope you guys enjoyed this. We got a lot to discover on this map. We got a lot to adventure. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next episode.